in this video you will learn to import data from excel file normally if you see in the connection in previous three videos of survey from the google you created a google survey using the form developed or question as developed in microsoft word and then you converted that google form into google sheet and downloaded in your computer now that downloaded file is stored as a Microsoft Excel file in the computer. Now this Microsoft Excel file to be uploaded in the SPSS for processing for further analysis. So this is the form collected from Google survey form and the data we got here are retrieved from the same google sheet and now this data to be uploaded in spaces for that purpose open spaces program go to the file and click on import data and choose excel and when you choose excel then you can browse from your computer from where that exists on the desktop maybe here and this one is my target file to import in spaces now you can click on open spaces will show you some processing information and there are some information what to accept what to reject or something like yes but everything is fine over here worksheet sheet is this one that i have to download or import here and you can also remove something leading from string values or something like that and if you want to see here all how it looks like it this is the preview of your form and there is nothing to do more and we can simply click ok now yes see everything is brought here in the variable view you can see here if you have to directly process the data without adding or subtracting anything from here the records then you can directly start that but if you want still to add more information or records here then you may need to change in the variables because you see the name of the variables are the questions in the google and see if there are similar questions then they are labeled a b c the same way and the labels are also the questions in detail and values are not defined so you may need to define the values if you want to add more information in x in spaces but normally whatever data is imported from excel is ready for further analysis for example if i want to go to analyze and descriptive statistics and descriptives and i want this monthly salary and then age in years two things for mean median mode variance range and then acutosis skewness or standard error mean so whatever i like then i can continue and click on ok now see this is how this value appears it comes in horizontal form and it will be hard for us to scroll left and right but there is another way to get the same statistics in a proper way or in a protect form or vertical uh, table so for that let's let's don't save this and then go to analyze descriptive statistics frequency and let's not display the frequency table okay and then select this age and then monthly salary and go to statistics and select mean median mode and then standard deviation variance range a minimum maximum standard error skewness and kurtosis and continue and click ok now see this seems nice average age in years and monthly and for these two variables this is what the information about 
see the mean standard error of mean median mode standard deviation variance is skewness kurtosis that's how you can start analyzing right away the form informations retrieved from the google to microsoft excel to the ibm sbss thank you for watching and if you like the video don't forget to subscribe the channel and also mention in the comment box if you have any questions about this all four series of the videos